Hello beautiful people, welcome back to my channel. I hope you guys are doing amazing. So today I'm back with my biggest haul yet. I spent over $500 on clothes for this trip along with as well as just clothes to spoil myself because it is my bad it was my birthday month. Um so as you can see I just got my new braids and how freaking cute are they? Lenny I said Lenny Kravitz, Zoe Kravitz inspire esque braids, but I'm obsessed with them. Anyway, so yeah, I have a haul and it's gonna be a combination of PLT, Princess Polly, and Shein. And all together, as I said, I spent about over $500 on this stuff. Um, I'm gonna do more of like an outfit type of thing so you can kind of see more of like what I'm going for with some of the stuff I picked. And I'm sure you're thinking to yourself, this girl definitely has a shopping addiction. 100% you would be right in that assumption, because I do. It's been acknowledged by my sister, it's been acknowledged by my family, they are fully aware of it, they've accepted me for my fault, but then again, like nothing's changing. It's all for the content. So I hope you guys enjoy this video, make sure to like, subscribe, and stay tuned for this epic haul. Alright guys, so the first package I'm going to start with is the Princess Polly package. Um, one of the things that I was really going for with this trip was wearing more comfort pieces. So I'm definitely rocking a lot more of the like um, rompers. Not comfort, but more like cute but comfortable I guess. So it's like wearing more rompers so I don't have to worry about like matching outfits and putting on a pair of trainers. That type of thing. So I've got a couple of rompers, I've got some jewellery. Um, got a couple cute tops, um, the whole nine yards. So, the first thing I'm gonna try on is this beige romper. So, we shall see. So, listen to this. I just found out that my cam my tripod has like a adjustable crank thing. Like an idiot, I've had this camera for so long and I had no idea. So, yeah, I thought you could but okay so this is the romper it's this beige romper I'm not gonna lie I'm not in love maybe because my hair is up or something but it's just not my favorite thing I really really love Princess Polly and obviously the prices aren't necessarily the cheapest so whenever I get stuff from that I generally have to like really really love it um it is cute but it's just not for me I don't know what about it I don't like maybe it's just the neck seems like too I don't know, there's something I don't like, but I got this necklace from them as well. Um, it's like connected and I really like it actually. Um, I don't really buy jewellery from like uh, online fashion brands just because the quality is always a bit shit, but um, it's okay. Not obsessed with it, but I can see it being cute. It's just not, not my favourite. But yeah, this is the concept I was going for. Very like quick and easy, put it on, get out of the house and still look really good. But unfortunately for me, this romper just not hitting the way I would like. So I'm gonna try the next one. All right, guys. So this is the second one. So funny enough, right? My first thought was like, okay, this generally just looks like a t-shirt that just looks too short. But I really quite like this. I think it's such a like, I don't know, very relaxed but like edgy. I can wear it with boots. I could wear it with trainers. But if you could see that, it's like shorts, it's like a big t-shirt. I don't know, it's just giving me like very work a day, fun, you know. I can I think I could definitely wear this at, U at Universal, which I quite like. So I do like this actually. I was a bit of like I picked it up and I was like, this could be a bit of a question mark, but obviously it's not giving me like oh fitted, but I really quite like that. I think it's very like Oh, this is playful, like fun. Oh. So yeah, I like this, yay. Okay, right, so on to the next pieces. So all the other stuff that I've gotten from Princess Polly are gonna be mostly tops. So now I'm gonna incorporate some of the PLT stuff um, because as you can see, I've got a nice little hefty package in here. Um, with PLT, because as you've seen in my previous haul, and if you haven't seen it, gotta have a look. But in my PLT haul, one of the things that I was obsessed with with PLT was their tall jeans. 
I have a pair of jeans from there that I'm obsessed with. And so, I decided to go a little in on the bottom wear and got like two, three pairs of shorts and another pair of jeans um, from PRT. So, I'm gonna try it on with one of these um, Princess Polly tops and then we'll just kind of switch a with the tops. How about that? Okay, cool. Okay, beautiful people. So, we have outfit number two. So this top is from Princess Polly and these jeans are PLT. Now, okay, I have two different things. I do love these PLT jeans. I love the length of them, as you can see. Oh, oh they're long, but as I say, as I always mention, I do have a butt and so these are very tight up top. Um, they fit, like as you can see, I've zipped them up and everything, but they are quite tight. With this top, I do like it, and I love the fact it's long sleeve, because I really hate short sleeve tops. It's just one thing I've not always been a fan of. But it is quite cropped. Um, and I'm always weird about my belly, but this is kind of a cute fit. I'm not even gonna lie, like this is kind of cute. You know, it's giving me like playful, but like not too much, like, uh, but uh. So like, I, I should have, this is the thing, I have them in another colour and I should have gone a size up but I was also worried that the waist was going to be too big if I did because the waist fit is just the thigh area that's quite tight. So as I see, as you see it does fit, it's just not much breathing, like I can't oh, pop a squat, like that's going to be quite, oh, oh, I'm definitely going to pop a seam, we, yeah. So, as you can see, it's a bit tight, so yeah. I'm gonna try on another Princess Polly top. Okay, beautiful people, so this is the next top from Princess Polly. Now, as I said, I'm not the biggest fan of short sleeves. They've always made me look really boxy, but I do, I just wish this top was long sleeve. Like, that's literally the only, if I could, if I had, if I had one wish, this top would be long sleeve. I just think it makes me look really frumpy, you know? Maybe, I don't know. I just feel like I look like a box in this. And it's like, I really, really like it, but it's just, it's like kind of frumpy. Like, if we're being honest, it's giving you frumpy vibes. Like, mwah, mwah, mwah. But yeah, it's giving me proper frumpy vibes and I don't like that, so. Unfortunately, this is a no for me because no one wants to be frumps, my gumps, like no one. So I'm gonna try the, I believe it's the last O Poly top and then I'll start trying on the other stuff from Shein and PLT. Told you this is gonna be a long one, so stay tuned. I promise it's not, you're not gonna regret it. Just stay on the video, promise. Promise. Okay guys, so this is the last um, Princess Polly top. It is a bodysuit, but obviously, for obvious reasons, I just can't be asked to tuck it in. Plus I wanted to show you that it was a bodysuit. But I do like this, I love the colour. It took me way longer to get into this than I'd like to admit. Um, I don't know why, maybe because I'm sweating. Um, as you can see, it's like, I call it glistening, but it's like proper sweat. Um, but yeah, I do like this, it's just a simple top with a little underline to it. Um, and I do love bodysuits, I just always feel a bit more secure in a bodysuit. As you said, I do like long sleeves, so not mad at it. Okay, before we get into the rest of the PLT stuff, I'm gonna go into the couple Shein tops I got. I will say that I did get some bathing suits from Shein too, but I'm not showing those because I don't really see all of this. You don't really see all of this. I'm joking, but yeah. Um, I can show you guys, if you guys want to see the bathing suits, you can let me know, but, um, like I could just show you them, but I'm not gonna show myself in them, but I will show you the tops, so. Alright, beautiful people, so this is the first top I got from Shein. I actually kind of like it, my boobs look real saggy right now, but it's just because of the brine wearing, it's like no padding whatsoever, which I love, but I quite like this, like I think it's giving me like, I don't know, I feel like it fits, it sounds weird, but it suits my hair. I would probably wear this with jeans, maybe not these type of jeans, maybe. Um, more like denim, denim looking jeans possibly, or um, maybe like uh, 
leather trousers or something but i do like this top it's very relaxed it's like pretty nice material it's not it doesn't feel like horrible which is like one of the big things with people with sheen but i do quite like it it's like comfy um i'm not mad at it at all so plus for sheen starting off with a w we like it this top i love i'm obsessed with nude browns that skip sk skip <laughs> that fit black skin um i love this brown color i'd probably wear a necklace or something but i would definitely wear it in exactly this outfit tuck it in um wear it with some trainers or something um definitely like this vibe get a necklace on get some jewelry and stuff but i really really like this top um super basic that was that was my aim with shopping at Shein. i didn't really want to get too many clothing items just because i'm very picky about quality of my clothes um so i tried to stick to like really basic tops and stuff and so far so good i really like the quality of this one like, this isn't shit quality which i was 100 percent expecting um but it feels really good i'm not mad at it at all and yeah it's just like brown just looks brown looks so good on black people i mean because we're brown but it's just like it just it just looks so seamless like whoo whoo i'm your venus i'm your fire your desire like yeah i love this top i'm definitely here taking this with me oh i keep trying to hide this i'm definitely taking this with me on my trip um tomorrow so on to the final Sheen top, I believe. Um, until the final Sheen top. Okay, so this is the one. I literally, as you can see, I legit only bought brown stuff. But this one, I think I'm really going to like. If it fits the way I want it to fit, I'm going to like it. So, give me a second. I'll be right back. So, I'm not the type to show my belly a lot. I really don't like it. Um, there's nothing wrong with my stomach. I just don't really like showing it. But this is really cute top. Like it's a very cute top. But I just don't know where I would wear this. Like, because I just, as I said, I don't really like showing my stomach like that. And it's a lot. I was hoping it'd be like here, like right there, right, right there, right there. But it's a little short up top, which is so annoying. But I do, I do think it's like a really nice. I think it's just such a creative idea, you know. It's not something you just kind of see everywhere, which I really like. But I wish it was longer. What do you guys think? You guys tell me what you think about this job. If, I mean, it's gonna be obviously a couple weeks later, but what do you guys think? Do you like it? I can't decide. I may give it up, but I'm not sure. But I really like it. I do like it, but I just, it's just like, it's just like, oh, like right there, like, oh. oh. Okay, you know what, it's fine. You win some, you lose some. But so far, all the sheen tops I loved. Um, PLT jeans, be careful of the booty. And I'm gonna try the last couple PLT pieces. All right, beautiful people. So I'm wearing two different PLT pieces. So one is gonna be these shorts. I probably should not have worn it with black top, but, but as you can see, these are like hem shorts. They're not like short shorts. These are like, I love these. There's like one of the biggest things with me with shorts is that right in this like below the bum before the vagina area, it always feels super tight. But because these are like hemmed, it just goes from like hugging the booty then free, like hug then free, hug then free. So I really really like these. I'm gonna lift up this bodysuit, but as you can see, this is a really cute bodysuit. I would definitely wear it with like straight leg trousers or something. Um, just to give it that little, more dinner vibe, but let me take out the bodysuit so you can see these shorts like where they start. So yeah, as you can see, they start like right above my um, belly button. For me, I will say I have the shortest torso known to man. Considering the fact I'm five eleven, my torso is about this small. So um, take that with a grain of salt. But I really like this top and short, not as a combo, but I love both of these pieces. All right, guys, so this is the other top. This is another bodysuit. Um, I actually kind of like this. I think I can accessorize this quite well, and I'd probably wear a bra with this because these girls look really sad. Um, 
this is like oh, the material that's used on like really popular dress that a lot of girls have and i do love the whole like it looks like renaissance vibes dude my boobs look so sad in this top what the heck like they look miserable um <laughs> but let's see if i can oh nips on my snaps like one second guys Ooh. okay they're, they're a little heavier but yeah this top i quite like actually i would definitely it's more like a outspoken thing so i wouldn't like it's not a bit not like a day-to-day -day piece but i think it's really cute um i like it and i love the fact it's on sleeve as you already know um so no complaints but also the top part is a little like weird maybe because of my boobs like i i do have a decent sized boob so it's like they're just, I don't know, they seem a little bit sad in these. Alright, final, final outfit. I'm going to enter, drum roll please. Alright guys, so this is the last top. These. <gasps> oh. Okay, so this top I really like. I love the colour. I love the little ruching down the sides. Um. These je these shorts, they're actually not bad, they're just too tight for me and I feel like I'm going to explode. Um, yeah, I just, I'm not, I'm not in love. Oh, but I did forget to add Mrs. Fanny Pack. Okay, no, this is looking way shinier than I expected. I don't know if I love this. It's a lot shinier than I thought it was going to be. Um, okay, I don't hate this actually. So it'll be very convenient, 100%. Wow, I don't even have to hold anything. My phone's gonna be right here in front of me. Okay, am I just figuring out how amazing fanny packs are? What the damn hell? Like this is, this is amazing. Just put it here, don't have to have anything. Like I can just free my mind. Oh, ow, sorry, my braids are still new. So they're a little tight, a little tight, just a little. Oh my god! Okay, I just wish it was a bit of a duller leather, but all in all, I am obsessed with this. Oh my god, did I just get put on fanny packs? Have I become a fanny pack lover? What the fuck? These are amazing. Like, uh, to be fair, I'm warming up to these shorts a bit more, but still. Oh my goodness, how have I never gotten a fanny pack before? Oh, the rock vibes. I said the rock when I did that. What the fuck? That makes no sense. Okay, go. I think we're officially finished with this haul. So I'm going to give you my final thoughts. We're going to wrap this up. And hopefully you stay tuned all the way to this point. Wasn't it great though? Like, wasn't it great? Okay, beautiful people. So my final thoughts. I was a little disappointed with Pete, um princess polly this time um i tend i didn't like more I, I think there was more pieces i didn't like than i did plt you need to fix the denim situation for us tall shapely people because that thigh move lack of thigh movement is just not okay um but some of the tops i'm not even joking i took like five minutes getting into this top it was so difficult for no reason because it fits fine but it was like so restricting at some points where I could not move my arm. Um, so yeah, fix that PLT. Um, Sheen, surprisingly coming in clutch with all their pieces. I'm not mad at it. Um, but all in all, pretty decent haul. I think I have some pieces that I can take with me to Universal um, soon. So that's really fun. I'm so sorry for being such a ghost. Like I swear, it's not my fault. I am now a nine to fiver, nine to sevener. Um, I am a software consultant, which I will do actually another video about now. So my workload is a lot, lot more than it used to be. So content is slowly, it's like a lot slower, which I'm so sorry for. But I promise I'll try and figure out my balance. Um, but I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Make sure to like, subscribe. Stay tuned for my vlogs coming up. So I should have an Orlando vlog coming right after this one. Um, but yeah, stay tuned. Love you guys. And have an amazing, amazing day. Bye.